we are going in. We are going full throttle with monster rates. And ooh, you can see right there, you can start ship off in another direction other than south. That's cool. Let's get started. Uh, oops. I always forget to do this. All right, so it said something about someone cheering us on. Something like that. Bummer. What? Okay, so we have to really be careful here. We just can't go along the path that... Bummer. Whoops, come on. Okay, wait just another moment. Okay, there we go. Go! Okay, so now we go this way. Go! Alright. We're in the lead. Whoa! I didn't know that was going up. Okay, let's be more careful. <laughs> the walker looks like he's just really stretching out his legs there. I love the idea of writing messages using these letters. Like, that's just really awesome. Okay. That wasn't so bad. 30 seconds. Alright. Trip wires. Watch your step. Okay, so I'm going to assume that we shouldn't be touching any wires here. Is that a correct assumption? I'm going to just go with that. Let's not touch any wires. And we were forced to get those, uh, um, the lightning bolt thing. I wonder what all this is connected to. I'm going to have to really study up on wires before I build some custom levels. Okay, we can go over here. Maybe if you trip the wires, there's going to be like tons of monsters flooding the whole area. Or something. Or maybe the exit will become unreachable. But so far we're doing okay. Let's make sure we got everything in here. Oh, there is a blob transmogrifier thing. Okay. Well, I don't know if I really want to see that in action. Not going to lie. I'm not sure if I really want to see that in action. Okay, let's go around the edge here. This would be interesting to optimize if um, you just threw caution to the wind and just decide to go everywhere and have the monsters flood the whole place. So I'm assuming that's what the green teleports are all about, right? In fact, you know what? Oh, here we go. We have to approach it from there. You know what? We got to this area last. So... Maybe we can engage in a little bit of risky business, if you know what I mean. Let's see how that works out for us. Once we get the last couple of ships here, we'll go back to the bonus flags uh, area, and then we'll see if we can grab everything. Ooh, go, 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 go. Oh boy, here they come. Here they come. Woo! All right, that was awesome. Apartments. Well, I guess there was uh, the original Ships Challenge One level was apartments. So, okay. Uh, can we go down? Did I accidentally switch off the focus? Of... Okay, there. No, no, no. Don't exaggerate my movements. Come on. Let's not do that. Game. Now is not the time to be all laggy. Come on, game. Please don't do this. Okay, it's doing something weird. There we go. <sighs> no! Please don't lag! I don't know why it's lagging. This... No, I don't... I didn't want to open up Star Wars... <laughs> Stop! I have no idea what caused that. And now it's pressing the left key and I cannot move anywhere right okay I have no idea what's causing it to start that up hang on a sec if I restart okay guys hang on I'll be right back in just a sec we're back I'm not sure what that was all about but now I can move around Whoop, need to do that again I can move around freely which is the main thing that we need to worry about so that's good. Oh, and we need to do some item swapping. Okay. I see what you're doing there, game. Let's do this. Okay, so we can go in here. 
And we can go in here to the water. Um, I guess fire is the one on the left. This is hot pink anyway, so... And I guess the suction boots lead us to the exits. There we go. And we're out of here. Whoop! <laughs> decisions! What kind of decisions? Oh. Oh. Oh, okay. Those kind of decisions. The ones that are life and death, if you want to call them that. Okay, I have a feeling that this is going to be pure guesswork mania here, so... Yeah. Let's go yellow. Okay, blue's the right one. Game, I really wish you wouldn't play the slidey noise after I die on ice. There we go. Blue is the correct answer. And let's get ourselves some... Oh, we got a little maze going on here. Ooh, I see you there. That's pretty cool. Okay, so we need to open up that toggle door to get that uh, 1k bonus. Alright. Oh, check this out. Okay, I bet these are all decisions as well. We need to be careful. Follow the yellow brick road. Um, I think for now I'm going to take this, just because we know that this actually leads to something that's not immediate death, so... Just see how this works out for us. Okay, well that was good. We got flippers out of that. What about this one? No! Okay, the third one's okay. Game, no, not that noise. Okay, thank you. This is a pretty coolly designed level. I like it. Alright, so... We don't take the hot pink path, we take the gold brick path. The yellow brick road, as it were. So let's do that. I'm gonna assume that the slimy path is right as well. No, no, it's not! Okay, so how do you get through the slimy area on that side, then? Ooh, look at all this stuff here! Check this out! Nice and open! I love it! I love open areas. Okay. I'm guessing that that area is where we would need to go. Oh wait, here we go. Need to get these. Get all the chips there. That's the spirit chip. We need to get these. And then we also... How do we get the toggles open? I think that's through here. Yes! What's over here? Oh! We could have gone through here. So what was the path that led up to the... Oh, that path, no! Oh, game, no. Game, why? Why have you, why do you, have you done this to me? Oh, not cool, yo. Okay, we can only go there through from the other side. Go through there. I don't know why I always mix up my words like that. It's one of those weird things. Okay, here we go. Go through the yellow path. Alright, I love this open water area. It just looks so sweet. Look at that. It's like you're about to lead a giant lake invasion of... Well, I guess it's not really an invasion. It's one guy swimming around. But hey... It feels cool to call it an invasion. Okay, I, I just want to feel my way around here. Where does this all go? It's just... Okay, this gets us one more chip. Nice! Awesome! Okay, so I think that will allow us to go back to the beginning, but first, I really want to do this. Make sure we get our 1k there. This would be worth it from a scoring perspective, since uh, that's a hundred seconds. And it doesn't take us a hundred seconds just to go all the way around the lake again. Here are those things we can get on the way out. I'm hoping the answer is yes, and they are. 
Alright, let's go down here. Hopefully this is not going to kill us. Please do not kill us. Yes! Alrighty, we beat decisions. And we can move on to Ouroboros. 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 Whatever. Round and round and round she goes. Round and round and round and round she goes. Oh, wait! Melinda's playing. We can't... Bummer. Right! I forgot about that. Okay. How are we supposed to do this? Ooh. Huh. Hmm. Are there, like, hiking boots under any of these? Please tell me there are hiking boots under the, one of these. Oh, wait! We've got the... Right! Bummer. We can We can walk on ice. I keep forgetting we can do that. I don't know why I keep forgetting we can do that. Oh, but how do we get through that? Oh. How do we get through that? Okay, Bummer. we've done this wrong. How are we supposed to do this? Like this? I'm pretty sure I was supposed to go about that the other way. I wonder if you can get everything. That's that's the question. Can you get everything? It doesn't seem like it if you want to be able to extract the ice block properly. Okay, where am I even going with this? I don't see how we can get that to the exit. Wow. This is crazy sauce. Okay, how are we going to do this? So pretty much, it seems like the... Um, yeah, you can't really get... Unless the 10 flag and maybe... Yeah, it's just the 10 flag that's connected to the mainland, as it were. So, yeah. You really cannot get all the bonus flags here. So how do you get to the exit? That's the thing. Do you have to tromp over the dirt? Maybe that's the key, is you have to tromp over the dirt. So let's just see. Try this out here. In fact, before we do that, let's try this out on normal... The normal stuff. No, 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 I didn't want to do the... Mm. Game. Now's not the time to be exaggerating the key inputs again. Let's not be doing that. Okay, so I think what you can do here is you can just totally... Yes, you can clear out the dirt this way. Okay, so you can do that. Sweet! Okay, so now we can just go through and get all the stuff. Uh, well, maybe. Hang on. Okay, so here I need to go through and do this, and then go around the turtles, turtle way. Bam! All right, we got everything. Sweet. I forget. I just keep forgetting the game elements properties, and they really come in handy on a level like this. I mean, I love the fact that you can push ice blocks over dirt. Vladimir grins. The timing on the next one is going to be a real problem. Easy? Okay. We got time 15. Oh my goodness. Okay. 15 as a time limit. Okay. Wait, what? How are we doing that? I don't get it. How are we... What? Huh? I can't control where I'm going. So how do you do that? Oh, okay, hang on. Okay. I think I get it. So, here's what I've come up with so far. Like, you have to cross like this. Yeah, like that. Okay. Okay. Perfect. Except not really, because we're about to die. 
Okay. So you have to use loops in order to get back. Okay, like this. And then like that. And then like this. Four, three, two, one. Boom, we're out of time. Okay. Somehow I have to make this even quicker. But how? Because I don't think I can change directions here. Yeah, I have to keep going. So let's see here. I'm just going to look at this real quick here. I'm just studying. Just trying to understand what we're dealing with. So... Okay. We have to keep going straight. We cannot turn there. Oh, we can get any one of those right away. Okay, well that helps. Okay, well let's do that then. Oh, except that's not going to work. Well, let's do it this way then. Oops, okay, hang on a sec. I know there's an order to which you're supposed to do this. There's got to be. Uh, let's just go down first. Okay. Three, two, one. Oh! Ah! Oh. Wow, this is this is kind of tough. You really have to figure out the optimal path here. Okay, so yellow and blue. Okay, so they kind of feed into each other from a like counterclockwise perspective. That's that seems to be how they work. But didn't we try that already? Like we we did this first, and then we did this next, and then we did. Yeah, okay, that's not gonna work. Maybe we try the opposite way. You know what? I'm feeling kind of lucky right now. Let's let's try that. Oh wait, we were supposed to do that there. Okay, let's let's do that then. I think that will actually save time. That's probably the key. Is you have to do it like that. Oops, I forgot again. Wait, wait a minute, I think I wasted time there. Maybe not, though. I'm still getting used to not having the full first second. I'm not sure if that's going to be changed for the game release or not, but I really hope it is, honestly. That wasn't enough? What are we supposed to do here? Okay. So pretty much, I have to visit... I can only make four stops, it looks like, and not counting the exit. And there are no extra chips, I have to get all of them. Right? Okay. So... Okay. So this way didn't really seem to do any good. I'm kinda disappointed. This, this way just seemed really awesome. What am I missing here? Hmm. Well, I guess I'll try going down again first. It seems counterintuitive, but maybe that is the right way. Except now I run out of time again! That's even slower than the first pattern that we did. Okay, let me just make absolutely sure that... Okay. So it does feed in there, the direction you're going. Hmm, interesting. So I guess the only places that you can really switch directions are at these points when you're coming toward them. Okay. I think we already tried this order where we get red first, and then we get this next, and then we get this. I wish I could turn in the middle. That would be amazing. <laughs> I just still can't get over the way he says that. Oh, that will always crack me up. Okay, so... I still cannot go backward there. That's, that's not possible. 
and I cannot do anything here in the middle as far as turning is concerned. I can only go keep going straight along my path there. Oh, man, how are you supposed to do this? Have I tried getting yellow first? I feel like that's just going to be the same story second verse, but let's just see. Okay, so far so good. And this happens yet again. See, I feel like there's something I'm missing with these railroads. Like, I, I can't switch here, like, at, at this point, where I'm standing right now. Is there something I'm missing? Are there hidden things? Is there a way to get through the socket without all the chips? I don't think there is. What am I missing here? This is really mind-boggling. And honestly, really frustrating. You know what? I'm just going to go with this one first. Makes the most sense. Oh, wait. Right. I can't do that. Oh, whoops. Okay. That's right. I can just go straight across. Duh. Okay, let's do this. Wait, I think this might actually be the solution. Yep, I think this is the solution. Wow, okay, I cannot believe... Oh, man. Check that out. We exited right on zero. Sweet. Okay, think fast is the next level. Okay, why do we have to think fast? What's going on here? Is it because there's not much of a time limit? Is there something else going on? There's a tank there. I'm just going to assume that this is an invisible maze that we have to go through in a very short time. So let's try that. We'll follow the left wall. Let's follow the left wall. We'll be systematic about all of our operations today. Following the left wall, following the left wall, following the left wall, following the left wall. Dun, 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 dun. That's from, what is that from? Is that Beethoven's Ninth? I think that's Beethoven's Ninth. Okay. See, I think this is just like a really tight time limit level. There's a lot of that in this game. I like that. I think it could use more of that in Chips Challenge 1 with all those super long levels. I really hope that my meandering around at the start didn't put us back too far. But hey, fingers crossed, we'll get this. Hopefully. Alright, so this is just a normal maze. Nothing crazy going on here, just running against the clock. I don't know what that tank and the fire are all about there in the upper area, but that was pretty awesome. Okay. 40 seconds left, and only 10 ships. Okay, this is going to be crazy. I don't know if we can do this. Nine ships left. Let's go ahead and get that. Yeah, this is definitely getting down to the wire here. I'm wondering, can you even get all the ships in this level in time? Because we would have to get out of the maze. Yeah, I don't know how you can do this in time. There must be like an alternate way to do this. Yep, we're out of time. Okay. Let's see if we can figure out another way to do this. Like, maybe doing this. Oh. Maybe not. Okay. Is there just stuff under these blocks? So wait, are those invisible walls? Wait a second. What's going on here? Okay, so those are... There's got to be an alternate way to do this. Flippers. Okay, what can we use these on? I don't see what we can use these on. Oh, wait! The fire! Right, the fire. Hang on. The fire. The fire. Okay. Yes. 
Yes, all right, we can get through. Excellent. And we can clone a fireball, and will this turn into... Bummer. Yes, it does melt the ice blocks, but I accidentally did that, so that was silly. Okay, that's a clever level, I like that. Let's see what you're doing there. Encouraging our critical thinking skills. Always cool. Wait, did I lose my flippers? What happened to my flippers? I don't have any flippers anymore. Oh, I never got them! Okay, hang on. Let's get our flippers. Man, this was a tricky one. I like the, the little fake out there. That was cool. But you're not fooling JB. Not by a long shot. Sibling rivalry. Uh-oh. This ought to be fun. So I guess we're going to be fighting over control of the doppelganger. That seems to be the case here. Except right now, this is not looking good, so I think we're going to switch over to you. Was that right? Oh, we lost him. Oops. Okay. We need to figure out what's going on here. So, whoops. I keep doing that. So let's switch over here. Okay, let's go back. Okay, that switches off everything. So, did that glider do something, or ship, as they, they call it, do something? Oh wait, I accidentally restarted, I meant to switch. Whoops. Okay, switch. Okay, let's go back down here. Excellent. Okay, now, switch again. That sound, man. Okay. I have to be really careful here. So I need to get fire boots. Like that. Okay. So that's how we do that. Then we go through here. There must have been a bomb or something there. Then we can get through here, and that's where we'll exit once we get everything. Okay. Okay, let's go put you down there as far as we can so we can get through all this stuff here. Wait a minute, I need to turn that on again. Bummer. What? Oh, I don't have fire boots! Oh, how am I supposed to transport the fire boots over? Oh, man, okay. This is gonna be fascinating. This is cool. Okay, so we go over here. Yeah, there is a bomb. Okay, excellent. So then we go down to this area. Do this next. Let's go back down there. Take you down a notch. Alright. So I think ultimately what we want to do is we ultimately want to get Chip down... Okay, we want to get this Chip <laughs> down over here. And then we get the other one... Is that how we do this? Okay, hang on. See, which one... Okay, that one's the one without the fire boots. I need to make sure that the fire boot man... Okay, I, I need to make sure I do this first for anything else. And we're running out of time, which is not good. Okay, so you need to get over to the other side, which is going to be interesting. How are we going to make sure that you can cross over here without hitting anything? Well, hitting me, since I think we'll die if we hit each other, right? Oh, we won't. Well, that's not bad. So going on ice also controls them. Okay, I'm learning all kinds of things about this doppelganger mechanism. It's fascinating, just to say the least. Okay. No, 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 no. I didn't mean to do that. Okay. Go down here. Good, good, good. Okay. 
Let's make sure we do this real quick. Get this over here. Oh, wait a minute. Maybe I can drop the boot for my twin here. Drop. Yes, okay. So now, if we were to do this and then we switch with you... There we go. Now I can use it for myself. And now you can go through here. Okay, that really wasn't so bad. I just had to remember that you can drop boots. Alright, binary. Remember the pattern. Oh, wow. Okay. Hang on a sec here. What pattern are we remembering exactly? What's all this? Nine... I want to see where this goes. Oh, this is Melinda, so she can walk on ice. Hmm. Okay, so what's the mechanism here? I'm trying to figure it out. Did we just completely mess this up? I bet we did. Okay, so is the pattern supposed to be... One, two, three, like one, two, four, five, um, eight, nine, ten, thirteen. Let's try that. One, two, four, five, eight, nine, ten, thirteen. Okay, did that do something? Did that do something? Or am I supposed to do this the other way? Where I do the blobs? Maybe I have to do the blobbed ones. So one, three, four, five. Okay, one, three, four, five. Eight, nine, ten. Thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. One, three, four, five, eight, nine, ten, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Okay. Okay, let me make sure I count this right. Five, six, seven, eight, wait. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. There's sixteen all in all. That didn't do anything? Oh man. What are we supposed to be doing here? I don't get it. So somehow these are all wired into the the um uh, um toggle door there. Remember the pattern. Yeah, but I don't get how you remember the pattern, though. So, 1, 2, 4, 5, 8, 9, 10, 13. Or are we supposed to bring the ice blocks down? Is that what this is for? Are the ice blocks for the pattern? I bet that's what they're for. Okay, that should be quite a bit. Okay, I didn't mean for that to happen. Uh, how do we rectify this, guys? I really did not mean for that to happen. Okay. This is kind of a level I'm not a big fan of. Uh, <laughs> I'm just going to go ahead and say it. First of all, I do not look forward to optimizing this. Second of all... I don't understand what you're supposed to be doing here. So two, four, seven, eight. I'm gonna write this down. Two, four, seven, eight, twelve, thirteen. Okay. So are those the ones we're supposed to hold down? Ultimately. Or are we supposed to hold down the ones that I'm gonna say we're supposed to hold down the ones that are uh Yeah, I think we're supposed to hold down the button ones. Let's just see, though. Let's try the blob ones and then the button ones. I really don't like the idea of having to fetch these things one at a time just because of this whole mechanism here with this. Let's see if this works. We'll, we'll test it out. I mean, I guess eventually we're going to have to bring all these ice blocks down anyway to bridge to all the chips. 
This is kind of a little bit tedious. At least that's what it's going to be turning into. I guess we can do two at a time, right? That won't hurt. Question is, is this going to actually affect things adversely, adversely if we press a button we're not supposed to press right away? So let's bring in two at a time. That will help. Two, four, and then we do seven, eight. Okay, so this one and this one. Something tells me we're not doing this right. And then 12 and 13. Whoops. Oh, man. Okay. You win. Let's do this. Okay, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, and 12, and then 13. Please tell me that's going to work. Yes, it worked. Awesome. Okay, deactivated everything. Fascinating. I wonder how that whole mechanism works. Good night. Look at all these logic gates here. Fascinating. Hmm. I'm really going to have to check that out, like how that all functions. Well, at this point, it's a matter of just bridging to all the other chips, which is going to take a while. See, I would have been fine with this level if this wasn't part of the challenge. Like, I really wish you didn't have to do this. That This just feels unnecessary. Like, why do you even have to do this? This is just tedium at this point. Bring all the blocks down here. I mean, why? What's the point of this? I mean, other than that, this level has an amazing idea. I mean, I love the concept of this level, don't get me wrong. It's just, why do you have to do this at the end? Oh well, I guess we needed at least one tedious level throughout all this, so... Let's do three at a time, because we can afford to do that. Because I think we can. Gonna press a button here, I think. Yep, okay. I'm glad we can do three at a time. That does help. If it was one at a time, I'd be kind of going, eh. I guess, come to think of it, since the pressing the buttons that you shouldn't be pressing doesn't really make everything bad or doesn't trap you in any way, at least you can, um, um, you know, at least you can take three down there when you're doing this in the first place, when you're trying to figure out the solution to the, the original puzzle. Okay, here we go. Transport you all over here. A little too far, but we made it. Alright, and that just leaves us with two remaining blocks. I'll give this level this, it's not on the rocks, so... That's something. <laughs> All right, here we go. All righty, we are almost done. There we go, and here we go. So now we just need to find the exit, which I think was back at the start. I just want to make sure it's not here along the slide, just so I don't waste any uh, pop-up walls. Okay, it doesn't look like it's on the slide. I do like the fact that the slide uh, goes all the way down there for a while. At least so you have time to get here before the blocks do. Yeah, here we go. We're done! Alright, and now you're almost halfway there, my friend. Just remember, sometimes you don't need all the chips. Everybody, so I had recorded a bunch of footage of this level because it is ridiculously difficult. And then the game crashed. And I decided that most of it was just me just kind of wandering around doing nothing for like half an hour and that was just going to be dumb to watch. So I decided to just go ahead and start over again because I completely forgot to heed Vladimir's warning about not needing all the chips. Um, now this level is a bunch of Soko bands, as if you can, couldn't tell already. Um, there you go. Um, and these are all based, I want to say, on the auto-generated series by Yoshio Murasi and company. 
And I think the idea is that you don't really have to get everything, but if you want to get all these bonus flags, you can. And I completely missed that. I thought you actually had to get everything. I don't know why I thought that. Um, but anyway, yeah, you don't actually have to get everything at all, which is nice. So, yeah, I'm going to try to see if I can figure out how to do this one. This is interesting. Uh, but I think what you have to do is you just have to create a path to get to a green key, and then you can exit. I don't really even know why there are chips in the level, um, even though the counter says 26, I have no idea why it even says that. So, yeah, uh, and I think I've already messed this one up, so... Thankfully, we do get a green eye here, which is nice. And, why did I do that? Come on. That's really dumb. Okay, um... Huh. Yeah. Let's try this. Pretty sure that this, this is not the way. <laughs> okay, maybe we should just go with a different set of puzzles in general. Um, yeah, there's a big inverter here. I guess if you really, really want to get all of the... Uh, um, the chips, you can go through this, and if you you get there in time, you can get the times two socket behind the door there, too. Which is cool, you know, if you really want to be a daredevil about it, but I just want to solve the level. I just want to solve the level at this point. I do not care. I just want to get out of here. I, it's been long enough. <laughs> I, I've just got to admit, it's been long enough. So, let's just at least try to get to one of those yellow, uh, those green keys. I have no idea if what we're doing here is right, but let's just give it a shot. Uh, yeah. Let's do this. Something tells me we have to do that, and then maybe move these up here. Or wait, wasn't that the way they were originally? Wait, we can solve this now. We can totally solve this now. What am I doing? I'm trying to be all fancy there. Alright. Okay, so now we can move on to number 8. And this will give us a blue, I think. Yeah, this will give us a blue key. Okay, so... Pushing that left would be a really horrible idea. So let's push... This... Well, pushing that up would be a horrible idea. So how do we solve this? I don't know how you solve this one. Uh, oh, here, you have to do this. Clever. Actually, this isn't so bad, because you can just push this into the corner there, and then the rest of it should be pretty easy. Okay. There we go, we can get more bonus flag goodness. Well, I guess we can get the chips if we want, but we really don't need to. Okay, so here's the last one in this sequence, if you want to call it that. Or we can go with this one. I guess we can choose any of these if we want. If we fail one, we can go to another one. Wow, I wish I knew about that earlier. See, earlier I thought you actually did have to solve every single puzzle. And I was so frustrated. I was like, really? You're requiring that? I mean, that just seems so mean. And I'm so glad that that actually is not the case. I'm very thankful for that. Because if that really were the case... You have no idea just the rage <laughs> that would be going through my veins right now. I mean, yeah. Okay, that, that should do it. Alright. So, I think I'm just going to go ahead and exit with all of these right now. We've, we've done enough. We've, we've done enough here. I wonder how many there are here. And this level title is called Crazy 1, so there's going to be a Crazy 2 eventually. I wonder if all the handmade levels by Yoshio Morasi will be in that one as well. Alright, well, we'll find out. But first, we got the latter half of the game to go through, and we'll do that in the next video. A very big congratulations, you've made it the halfway point. And we will start off with Tank Blocker next time. So until then, take care and I will catch you on the flip side.